What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and today my capture card has finally arrived. So I'm gonna have a little scene right now of me um, unpackaging my capture card and then we'll move on to a kind of like a, a cam view close up and unboxing of the unboxing. What's up guys, welcome back to this unboxing of my Katsu Kitty 3DS capture card. So if you can see down on the main cam here, we have the capture card outside of the initial packaging. The struggle was way too real in that packaging unboxing section. But yeah, so on the outside, it just looks like your standard 3DS, your blue 3DS. And then also, I actually ordered two of these uh, mini USB cables just as a, um, just to have one as a backup, but apparently they only wanted to send me one, so I'll have to message them about that. So to see what I can do about that. But anyway, so we got the the love note. They send out with every one of these, from what I know. It says my serial number. What else we got? How to install a driver. All that sort of stuff audio connect this kind of just telling me how to use use the software that comes with it yeah thanks for purchasing your Nicetro what are they what do they call it a night and Nicetro capture interesting anyway I can read that later you guys can pause and have a read of that if you'd like but now we're on to the actual 3DS itself. So from what I know it should just look like a standard 3DS. So let's slide all this out. What do we got? So you got your standard books that come with the 3DS. Nothing nothing too fancy there. Um, and then let's go inside of here. There we go. So there's the DS itself. And then inside of there is just the rest of the packaging. Cool. So slide that out nice and gently. Nice and shiny. Just my fingerprints on the on the side there now. Gotta make my mark. But yeah, so it looks like your standard 3DS. It's got the got the stylus. But then on the top here, that's where the capture system is in let's see if I can get a, some sort of decent focus on that but anyway yeah so it just looks like your standard 3ds except it has the capture ability so yeah screen's nice and clean like brand brand new kind of clean and yeah so you get your your USB so let's let's have a little example here and from what I know Obviously that goes into your computer, and then this mini cable here should go straight into the back of here. Come on. Make sure I got it going the right way. Yeah, there we go. So cool. Sits in nice and neat. You can't even tell that there's any anything being done to it. And yeah, so you just sit that up and play away. Yeah, that's that part. Let's let's do a comparison. Just give me a second. I'll have a quick cut. Alrighty, yeah, we're back. So I have my my 3ds. So I've got the blue one as well. So they sent me blue for blue. And as you can see, uh, there's literally just nothing different to it. Let's just unplug this. Move that out the way. 
Um, turn that off. Yeah, so let's have a quick squeeze here. So there's your comparison, so you can see where they throw it in. So, right next to the infrared, just kind of tucks in neatly. That's my one up top, and that's the capture card down the bottom. So yeah, it's all the same. Looks nice. And I'm so glad it took five months for this thing to arrive, and I'm so glad it's here. And next, we'll, um, next in this video, we'll have a test of the capture, capturing device itself. Alrighty, as you guys can see, it is awesome. It looks good, it sounds good. Oh, hear that cry, that is sweet. Not even bad. Oh, look, it's evening. So yeah, I can literally look at the screen and play at the same time. I don't have to look down at my DS, it's literally the response is spot on. This is crazy. Alrighty, so I'm going to a recap for my um, Katsu Kitty 3DS capture card. One of the cons, like, we'll start off with the cons. Pros and cons. Cons. It took five months for it to be shipped so I bought it back in June it is now November and it has just been shipped and has arrived pros about that it was express shipping um, con they forgot a USB cable pro I'm hoping they'll get back to me tomorrow <laughs> uh, they're usually pretty quick with their um, customer service through to the emails. I know I contacted them a few times for an address change and all that sort of stuff and they got back to me pretty quickly. Um, Pro, it looks like a standard 3DS. There's no big bulky kind of uh, side package to it. It's all there. It all just looks normal. And the only thing I could probably say that's wrong, and this has been really picky, is that the um, uh, the little USB slot? Where is it? Just there, is slightly crooked. But that's going down to the nitty nitty gritties. Um, but yeah, um, overall audio and video. Um, the video, it is a little bit pixely, but you gotta you gotta remember that it is coming off a 3DS XL screen. And then you're trying to get it to a like an LCD 1080p, you know what I mean? So it's um it's expected that it's going to be pixely. Audio. I had an issue initially setting up the audio. It wasn't very uh, beginner user friendly um, to figure out how the audio worked. But what you can do is literally through the USB, you just plug it in, and you can actually get the audio to your computer without having to plug 
anything into your headphone slot. If you want better quality, you can use the audio jack and plug it into the audio in, in into the back of your computer, and you can get a nice round sound um, sound to it. But what I noticed was you can just go into your DS settings, um, change the audio to stereo, and then just use it directly through the USB, and it was all, all good and it sounded pretty good. That's what you guys heard in the clip just prior to this kind of outro. Um, but yeah, overall, I'm quite impressed. Uh, shame about the weight, but obviously that's what you have to do to get these kinds of things now. The, uh, it's about, you know, it's, uh, supply and demand. It, they just didn't have the staff to deal with the demand because these things are just the most wanted things ever at the moment, apparently. But either way, very impressed with this. Can't wait to start recording with it. And if you're a current sub subscriber, a member of the Amity Empire, expect some um, gaming content as well to go off my TCG openings. Not sure what I'm going to do schedule-wise about it, but we will see in the near future. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys kind of enjoyed, I don't know, just seeing my experience of my unboxing with this cat catsy kitty, seeing my first kind of reaction to uh, the game, like Alpha Alpha coming up and hearing it and seeing it, it was, yeah, it was a really good experience. But thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.